Hello folks, um, thanks for watching. Uh, right now I'm actually gonna do a quick demonstration of the web browser in the Nuke color from Barnes & Noble. And uh, we are just gonna open the uh, web browser here. So right now um, it's, it's actually in the Facebook mobile edition, the touch edition of the website on Facebook and as you can see um, it browses very smoothly the drawback with this browser is it does not support multi-touch so every time you have to zoom you probably have to press a button on the bottom corner uh, for some websites let me go see I'm gonna open a USA Today's website right now I'm on Wi-Fi and you can see the loading speed is quite amazing amazingly quick alright so right now we're at USA Today's website it's a full website with uh, option to zoom so you have to press you have to kind of move the screen a little bit for the zoom button to show up and then you can press the zoom to zoom in or you can double tap zooms in and zoom out in one level only so anytime you want to further zoom in you have to press this button and press again so to get into the level and uh, the screen is really beautiful it displays a lot more detail than uh, what's what I can show on uh, my iPhone 4 screen even though the resolution is kinda same uh, just because the screen is larger and you can see when I'm dragging around it's kind of smooth, smooth enough and without causing too much trouble or jagging around. And click a link. And it's loading. So the Wi Fi is pretty quick. Double click to zoom in. And I'm going to zoom in, and you can see the text and how well it is displayed. Sorry for the flickering, um, it is a problem with the camera, not necessarily the LCD screen of the Nook. So really sharp and very nicely displayed. Zoom out. Alright, see if there's something else I can show you guys. It also supports uh, different characters, it supports uh, actually simplified Chinese websites. All the characters will be displayed correctly, but the only problem uh, with the original firmware is that it cannot type anything in Chinese, which is a drawback for me. International Movie Database. Uh, the browser does not support Flash, so anything uh, that requires Flash to play back, it will give an error. And with YouTube, uh, it actually switches to the mobile website, and I believe it is using HTML5. Uh, to display a low resolution video instead of the high quality video available on YouTube. See, um, when I try to click a flash uh, video file, it gives me an error asking me to install flash. And the browser itself is identified as a Mac browser for some reason, uh, which is quite interesting to know. Alright, this is, uh, thanks for watching, this is a video demonstration of the web browser in the Nuke Color e-reader by Barnes & Noble.